What's up everybody, it's your boy Precise Thoughts coming to you right now about to do a tutorial about pianos. Simple, basic, yet effective. Everyone loves pianos, any genre, everyone uses pianos. So, uh, well maybe not, but pianos are great. So, <laughs> let's get into it. Uh, this is the melody that I have created and you can check it out. That was with the effects though. Let me let you hear the dry melody. That's pretty much it. So, uh, first thing I want to talk about is the VST I'm using, which is True Pianos. Things I love about this uh, particular VST is that it's very simple. It doesn't take a lot of PC up. doesn't kill your PC. Um, so when you have a quick, fast idea and you want to throw a VST up just to lay down an idea or a thought for a beat, you can pull this up, no problem. Um, lay something out, and then you can always change it later if you want to. Um, but you got some great sounds in here. Um, I love the fact that you have modules here you can select from. So you got six different modules and you have i don't know this is just the 1.9 version so i don't know if any later versions have different setups but um you also have for each module you have a list of presets here and you can also adjust everything else on the sound itself um another thing i love is the is the reverb that it has here you can adjust the reverb amount and the room size so um that's pretty dope um uh, moving on what I want to get into here is the plugin that I'm using. The plugins that I'm using is uh, from the Waves Bundle. This particular plugin is the Maserati VX1 Stereo. Pretty dope. Not much to say about it. It's pretty simple. Very effective. Um, it's going to give you a great sound. Basically, um, it's used for... Um, vocals mostly um but you can also add it to instruments it sounds great this is a preset but i've also just altered it a bit to my liking and i suggest you do the same um and i'll let you have a listen to it this is without and this is with it you hear how bright and crisp it got when I added the effect to it um, is pretty pretty uh, versatile plug-in and pretty simple at the same time um, you have three different contours you can use it contours the sound you got delay mix delay decay verb tone different uh, little things you can do you can add bass you can compress treble output it's just a great sound and plug-in um, Moving on to the next plugin, and I'll let you hear the dry version of the melody once again. You got H delay stereo. So if you want to check something out for a delay, I was gonna go with the Manny M plugin, but um, I usually use that, so I just want to try something different. Um, so I put up the H delay from the Waves bundle yet again. Um, what I love about this plug pro um, plugin is the easy ease of use. The interface is pretty simple. It everything is right here. It's laid all out for you. Um, I love this ping pong effect, where everything's bouncing from the left monitor to the right, or speaker or headphones, whatever you're using. Um, I love that effect. You can turn that on or off. Um, you can sync it to your host. And I'm using FL Studios, my host, so it'll sync it to the BPM there. Pretty simple. It's one fourth of the beat. The delay is, is letting you know right here. Uh, you got simple knob for your timing, for your delay timing. And you got a simple knob for your feedback. Um, initially, this default was pushed up a bit. And you'll hear how cluttered it sounded when I used this preset in the beginning. Hear how cluttered that is. Um, so yeah, I just pulled that back. I just used this preset because it was um 
one fourth and it it was on time pretty much like the altar presets and the wet was pushed all the way up if you have a wet 100 percent on a delay it usually give you a pre-delay meaning that um it'll be off <laughs> i don't know any other way to describe it the delay will start the signal instead of the actual signal itself so it gives you a bit of a pre-delay like a delayed playing of the of the melody so i have that pulled back and i'll give you an example of that here so as you can see when i put it to 100 percent it was it throwed it off um yeah that's pretty much it um oh I talked about the modulation and the, the modulation rate is something that I love about it. You you have depth of modulation and the modulation rate and you have filters, high pass and low pass filters. I, I love that about this this uh plugin. What I did, um it can this preset was the low pass was all the way down, so I just pulled it back just to cut a little bit of the highs out on my delay. And that was all I did. And so now I'll let you guys hear the Maserati VX1 along with the age delay and just see how two simple plugins can really affect the sound um, of a piano that it may sound nice initially, but just to give it a little bit more spice. So you can see how bright, clear and vibrant that sounds um, It's really shining right now. Um, another thing I want to um, talk about is that particular delay. A lot of people say, hey, you know, that delay sounds kind of heavy and whatnot. But um, don't go based off of how your soloed instrument sounds when you're composing. Because let me give you an example of what I'm talking about. Um, it sounds heavy. Yeah. And I normally I wouldn't recommend to make a delay that heavy. But um when it in the mix here you can listen to it it doesn't overshadow anything so it's sitting there you know playing along with everything and you've just got your delay and all it's doing is just filling out making it sound more fatter and it's filling out you know the space in the track and you really want to do that you don't want to overdo it, but you know, you want to make it nice. You want to make it sound good. But, <laughs> but yeah, that's pretty much it, man. Peace out to everyone. Thanks for listening to uh, my tutorial. Thanks for watching my tutorial. And um, subscribe, comment, like, and share my video, please. I don't have a lot of subscribers, so I'd really be, you know, grateful if you would subscribe. Um, comment. Let me know. If you guys want to see any other tutorials and, and what type of tutorials do you want to see um, from me in the future? Oh, it's your boy Precise Thoughts, man. I'm, I'm out right now. Peace and thank you guys for checking everything out.